So what's it like to be with a patient? It's a privilege because you're really facing one of the greatest challenges of their lives. So they put a lot of trust and hope in you as the physician to steer them in the right direction. I do remember one patient. It was actually when I was a physiotherapist and it was a young man. It was a trivial accident, diving in a pool, and he broke his neck, and he was quadriparetic. And I remember feeling um, almost useless because I couldn't make these muscles move. But what I took away from that was he relied on me as a support. He looked forward to my visits every day, and I thought to myself, caring for someone is beyond fixing them or curing them, but it's actually being supportive of them and so I think it's helped me adapt to the fact that we, we deal with diseases that are progressive for which there may not be cures but that our role in, in being very supportive of them, lifting their spirits is so important. So I'm the leader of a group of about 34 neurologists and about a dozen um, associated neurologists. The reason that uh, I was interested in establishing an interdisciplinary clinic was based on knowing the benefits that an allied team could offer to individuals with Parkinson's disease and other movement disorders. We now have one of the best clinics in Canada. My earliest memory where I actually thought oh, I admired the dedication of an individual. Now, not that I was going to do that, but it was watching Nadia Komenich win 10 out of 10 on all her Olympic activities. What I recognized was that she was so driven to be excellent and she achieved it that it marked me and I thought, wow, if she could do this, you know, what could I do if I really put my mind to something? What surprises me is sometimes the resilience that I've witnessed in some patients who seem to have, you know, been dealt unfairly, perhaps a really devastating disease. Sometimes these are the patients that teach me the most about having dignity in their suffering. I would have thought it would be extremely difficult to care for someone for whom there really isn't much of a treatment, but surprisingly, they are so grateful for being able to come to the clinic and just the encouragement that we give them to know that somebody cares, it's amazing.